In 1992, recognizing the need for a modern power system, the Roatan Electric Company began operations. It was managed and led by the local community under agreement and transferred by the Congress of the Republic of Honduras. In 1993, the first RACO Board of Directors was established. Eight Roatan residents came together to lead the direction of the company. When we started, there were three, three towns that has it has uh, generators like Oak Ridge, French Harbor, and Coxing Hall. There were three different owners, and Ene used to run it for them. What RECO and the government did, you know, they just put a new transmission line, and they just started with their own machines. The company was administered by local residents as power needs for the island grew. And in 2008, Clyde Warren Energy Investments acquired majority ownership and assumed management of RACO. Thus began a massive investment in the infrastructure to provide for the future energy needs of the people of Roatan and a period of development that seen RACO become the economic engine for sustained growth on the island. Just remember, you know, because um, I'd obviously been at, at RACO before, um, Kelsey Warren took over. And I was there right up to the point where um, there was no electricity and the, the power was going out very often. And um, to me, uh, when Kelsey uh, decided that he was going to get involved uh, with his investment into RACO, finally we were going to be able to have uh, a point where we are going to start to get stable electricity. Uh, and, the other, and the other feeling was a, a, a very, uh, you know, a lot of a very positive feeling, was very optimistic about all of the, all of the projects that we were going to start, start doing. Through the years, RACO has expanded from initially providing power to 2,546 customers in 1993 to over 17,320 in 2018, a seven-fold growth in base customers. As part of the dedication to the people of Roatan, investments in distribution, generation systems, including state-of-the-art technology, are ongoing. During the past 12 months, RACO has continued to expand with projects to provide more people dependable service and high-quality infrastructure that's resulted in RACO becoming the most reliable producer and distributor of energy in all of Honduras. The new technologies brought to Roatan are recognized as leading edge, not only in the Caribbean, but in all of the world. Investments have resulted in generation capacity increasing from 6.6 .6 megawatts in 1993 to over 41.9 megawatts in 2018. Included are modern generators that are capable of using a variety of fuels that offer a more reliable energy supply and increase safety and environmental standards that contribute to the welfare of the island. Well, we knew when we got here in 2008, we needed to replace all the generation facility and even doing improvements on the grid. So we looked out and tried to find the best, uh, most economical uh, power generation type technology that we could find. And we found that in Wartzilla nice clean burning um, generation and uh, very reliable, very dependable and uh, so that's what we chose and so we have spent a large amount of money on that project uh, to include the LPG fuel farm uh, that we have that most people will see when they drive by RICO and so we're very proud of that plan. As part of our dedication to the community, RACO will soon bring power to the people of the island of San Elena, a great electrification project benefiting more than 800 local residents and setting the stage for the development of that community. The development of renewable energy continues with RACO's latest challenge, a solar energy generation project in the works for the near future, which will produce another 10 megawatts of clean, renewable energy to Roatan. Project completion is scheduled for late 2019 or early 2020. So our, our future, that including a subsea cable that we're laying over to Helene, and so we're very excited about that, and so are they. Uh, they're very excited that they're going to have energy for the very first time. And we're excited that we're going to be able to provide it to them. 
And so we'll be there by February, March of next year. We'll, we'll be in a position to provide energy over that way. So it never stops. We, uh, from the subsea cable to the solar energy to the expansion of this plant when it's needed, uh, it will never stop. RACO is more than energy production and delivery. RACO is our people. They are, and I mean, it's, you know, obviously we're proud of our employees because they're like our children, so to speak. But hearing it from, from, from outside people, like the engineering company, uh, like our suppliers, Ward Silla, for instance, and they have nothing but praise for our employees, and that, that's, that's heartening when they said, hey, you guys are great guys, they're owning the plant, they're doing a great job running it, and so all of those, all of those comments that, that we hear, um, you know, that, that just, uh, uh, you know, that just consolidates what, what we feel, and we have invested a huge amount of money um, in training. RACO contributes more than 130 jobs directly to the workforce, and through ongoing collaboration with our partners, RACO contributes additional value through mutual efforts and dedication to local businesses. RACO has been, what, like a school to me? So much experience, right at the moment, I don't know which one to choose, but really, there has been a lot. We started off with five people maybe, one person in accounting, one in customer service, the manager, the assistant manager, that was practically the whole group. I'm very proud to be a part of RACO, and my message to the co-workers is that they put their best effort in being part of RACO and helping RACO to grow. Twenty-five years in the service of the island of Roatan is a big responsibility, and RACO gives back with a strong social commitment supporting community development in education, health, and strengthening local social organizations. In 2019, a new customer service and administration building will be complete that will allow RACO to provide customers better service with state-of-the-art technologies. Committed to the long-term development of Roatan Island and its people, we are RACO. Celebrating together 25 years of constant growth and dedication to our customers and to the future of Roatan. <laughs>